How's it going guys? Welcome back to the Pilot Patriot channel. All right, hold on one second. All right, now as you can see, today we're gonna to be reviewing a gas mask. This is the Mira Safety CM6M gas mask. And this is far from one of those old surplus gas masks that you see at the flea market. This thing is gonna give you full CBRM protection. That's chemical, radiological, biological, and nuclear. This is probably one of the best gas masks on the market that you can get. And there are a lot of reasons why I chose this one to review. But before we get into talking about the gas mask itself, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. Please give us a thumbs up. We really appreciate that. Now let's get right into it. Now I know there's a stigma around people that own gas masks. You picture the guys from Doomsday Preppers and things like that. But if you ask me, it really is a must have item. If you're into preparedness, I like to try to be prepared for almost anything. And having a good gas mask is definitely gonna be part of that list. So first let's talk about the design of this thing. Now as you can see, there is a big difference between this and those old Israeli gas masks that you always see. One thing I love about it is that it's fairly low profile as far as gas masks go. So it's not gonna interfere with your movement and things like that, especially when you're shooting. And we will do some shooting in this mask a little bit later. And one of the main things I love about it is the large field of view. As you can see, this uh, face shield pretty much is as wide as your whole face. It's gonna give you a 180 degree field of view. It's also made from an impact resistant polycarbonate material that's really gonna resist breaking and scratching and things like that so you don't have to worry about compromising the integrity of the mask. Another really nice feature that you only see on the high-end gas mask is the drinking tube. So it does have an integrated drinking system and then you can see it has this little tab here on the bottom. So what that's gonna do on the inside there, it's gonna rotate that drinking tube in front of your mouth so you can drink from whatever you need to drink from. Because one thing you definitely don't want to do, if you're in a situation where you have to wear a gas mask, um, you don't want to have to take it off to take a drink or anything like that. So that drinking tube really comes in handy. Something else that's usually an add-on item, but it actually comes with this mask, is the canteen that works along with this drinking system. It's also compatible with Camelback and other water bladders. So that's really nice, really convenient. And you can see on the back here that it has this really nice five-point head harness with tons of adjustment so you make sure it's nice and secure to your head. Now I'll go ahead and show you how to put this on. Now there's several different ways to do this, but I'll show you how I do it and how to make sure you have a nice secure fit. So what I like to do is just kind of get both hands in here and put that mask over like that to make sure that I'm getting a really nice tight seal. You also are gonna wanna go ahead and take a hold of those straps and pull them back to make sure you have a nice secure tight fit to your face. And now what you should be able to do is to cover up these ports right here and breathe in and it should just suck to your face. There shouldn't be any air escaping. So if you just cover those up, you can see that it really just sucks to the face. That lets you know that it's got a nice tight seal is that no unwanted air is getting in from the edges here. Other thing I want to note while I'm thinking about it is that Mira Safety does have gas mask options for children and infants as well if that's something you're concerned with if you have small children in your family. And something else that you might have noticed is how clearly you could hear me while I had the gas mask on. Obviously you're not hearing me as clear as you are right now. But this mask has a built-in speech diaphragm that's going to make it a lot easier to hear you so you can communicate with other people while you're wearing the mask. That's something that with a lot of other gas masks you don't get. Well, as soon as you put that mask on, nobody can understand anything you're saying. So that built-in speech diaphragm is another really nice feature. Now another thing about the construction of this mask is that it is made with a bromine butyl rubber that is going to be very resistant to all those chemical compounds that you're going to be concerned about when you're wearing a gas mask. It's also what gives you that really nice tight seal. One other concern that you may have with a gas mask is worrying about it fogging up. That's not something you have to worry about with the mirror safety. As you can see on the inside here, it's got this full rubber piece here that's going to cover your nose and your mouth and make sure that all the air that you're inhaling and exhaling is coming down out of these ports and not going up and fogging that mask. So you're going to have a nice clear field of view no matter what. Now talking about the filter ports, it does have two ports on both sides here. So you have the option of running your filter on one side or the other, or you could possibly run it with two filters if you wanted to. That's gonna allow you to keep the mask on longer without having to change filters and things like that if you are wearing two. Two would also allow you to breathe a little bit easier because you're pulling in air from two different areas. If you are only gonna be using one canister, it does have this plastic cap here that you're gonna put on to seal whatever side you're not wearing your canister on. 
Something that you may want to be thinking about is if you're going to be shooting, you want to make sure that you put the canister on the opposite side so it's not going to interfere with you shouldering your rifle. Now this will accept all standard NATO 40 millimeter canisters, but something that Mira Safety has done that's just revolutionary is they've come out with their own filter here. It is going to give you full CBRN NBC protection, but what's different about this canister, most of them that you find are going to have a five to seven year shelf life. This canister by Mira Safety has a 20 year shelf life. So just like all preparedness items, you want to be able to set them and forget them until you need them and not have to worry about going in and changing them out. So stock up on these Mira Safety uh, CBRN filters and these things are going to last you pretty much a lifetime as long as you keep them sealed up and store them in a cool dry place. Now this gas mask is used by militaries and law enforcement all across the world so you know it's a good product. Now something I do want to point out is that it doesn't have the certifications to be used by the United States military but that's not something I'm really concerned about and it does meet the EN 136 1998 class 3 requirements and all that really means is that it is a good product it is going to do what it says it's going to do and you get all that for a very affordable price a gas mask of this quality with these kind of features is usually going to run you upwards of 300 dollars or more this one you're going to be able to get for far under that and i will link to as many of these things as i can in the description below now let's really test this thing out we're going to set off some smoke grenades we're going to get out here on the range and do a little rifle shooting with this mask on so you can see how that works so stick around All right, guys, now I hope you liked this video. I hope it helped you out. If you're in the market for a good gas mask, you cannot go wrong with the mirror safety. And don't forget, guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And if you want to help support the channel, you can do that by joining us over on Patreon and Facebook. Uh, you can also visit pilotpatriotapparel.com. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, share, and subscribe, and stay prepared.